This bakery is run by Rafay Saleem, a British Pakistani. He brings money into Pakistan's economy and provides jobs. He's got an outlet here, but the business started in Bradford, where Rafay's father first opened a small shop. He introduced us the skills he learned from UK. He passed it on to us and we are using the same skills and making cakes and biscuits on a daily basis for the local community. It's people like Rafe and hundreds of thousands of other Brits of Pakistani origin who'll now get to vote here. By a quirk of history, the majority of the UK's Pakistanis come from this one small town, Mirpur. It's a place some now refer to as Little Britain. British Pakistanis are going to be able to vote in Pakistan. What do you think about that? I think it's a brilliant idea. I think they should vote. The grandfather, the parents, everybody, they, they were born and bred in this country. So we've got a lot of heritage, a lot of linkage to this country. So I think that's a very, very good idea. Um, doesn't absolutely make no difference to me because it's not something that I want to get involved in because the politics here is a very dirty game. That hasn't stopped British Pakistanis investing in homes and businesses in Mirpur to the tune of millions of pounds. It's thought around 200,000 people from the UK visit Mirpur every year. Western-style streets have even been created to cater for them. Well, there is so much travel between Mirpur and places like Birmingham and Bradford that it sometimes feels like one community just split over thousands of miles. Right here in Mirpur, you can get all of the home comforts of the UK and you can even pay in pounds. At Mirpur's radio station, they've got a phone-in program that goes out both here and in Yorkshire with callers from both sides. We just want to give them the feeling that they are with us every time, every moment. And this, like, the special purpose behind this transmission was to like, bridge the gaps between Pakistan and UK and so that people could not feel that they are away from their relatives, from their family members, from their friends. Perhaps unsurprisingly, most of this station's callers support British Pakistanis getting the vote here. Many, like Rafay the baker, feel even though they're British, they have so much invested here, they deserve to have a say. But there will be those both in Pakistan and in the UK who will have concerns about loyalties being split. Alim Mabool, BBC News, Mirpur.